Katia V5, this will be regarding wrapping. So I have over here a Lego car and within demo optimizer we're gonna see the wrapping feature. It will be quite similar to silhouette but let's see the main difference. So we have for the definition we can do a selection. In this case I can go for the product, for example the Lego car. And by default we're gonna see the grain set to one millimeter. If I will hit preview, we're gonna see the processed wrapping will look like this. And visually, if you're gonna take a look at the model compared to the one that we had in step, we're gonna see that this has an offset surface that that will follow the model like this. So in some areas, depending on the grain size, we're gonna see how material will be added. For example, over here where we have this black pole over here, we're gonna see how the mesh will look. If I will change the offset ratio, this will be to zero. If I will go, for example, to 0 0.5, we're gonna see how that will look differently now. So we have some more coarse geometry over here. If I will go all the way to one with the offset, we're gonna see that even more material will be added over, the, over there. So I can go, for example, with three millimeters and this will add more material onto every, every surface. So this will act similar to an offset. We also have the possibility to go and define a cubic wrapping and this will make it look um, made. So the model will be defined by voxels. This will be, let's say, most similar to Minecraft. As we can see over here, if I will move this to one, we're going to see how we're going to have more all of those um, those cubes defining this. We can go with 0 0.5 in this case. We're going to see that the result will now have almost 50,000 faces as a result. So in this case, triangles, because this will be a triangulated mesh. We can go with 0 0.1 and this will add even more geometry. We see that Katia will now um, do a little bit of processing in order to convert all those voxels. And in this case, the wrapping um, has a not responding over here, but keep in mind that this will process. It will just take a little bit of time since um, it does require some computing. A similar result can be obtained within Blender if you are familiar with uh, voxels. So you can have the same uh, conversion over there. But as we can see, we can do it over here directly. In this case with 0 0.1, even over here, we're gonna see how many small cubes we're gonna have over there defining that. And regarding the flagpole, it will look like this. So in this case, the result will have 1 million triangles. So just like simplification, this wrapping feature is mostly used for visualization. And in some cases, if you have some um, some products that maybe would be wrapped, you can do a rapid offset like this. It will also receive the color, so this uh, dark blue, similar to to a wrapping um, material. Okay, so that's about everything regarding this. When you save it, just like with the other um, tools over here. Within Demo Optimizer, you can save this as a CGR, WRL model, and STL. Okay, so I hope that you find this content interesting because Demo, Demo Optimizer is a workbench that is not very popular between CATIA users. Therefore, I decided to make this, uh, this series re regarding this. Okay, so that's it. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.